this water main break this morning. You can see it behind me. You can see that hole in the ground debris that's scattered everywhere. Now there's 10 customers in this area without water. A geyser of water shooting several feet into the air. A truck stuck in the mess after Pennsylvania American water officials say the driver seen here drove through it. It kind of sounded like a bulldozer scraping the street, and there has been water main breaks around, so I didn't anything of it really. And then whenever I left to go to the gym and seeing there was a truck, I guess, kind of got stuck down in there. And I leave that way to go to the gym. I was kind of glad I waited. Water officials say an eight inch cast iron water main busted along Cherry and School Streets in West Mifflin at around five o'clock this morning. The cast iron main is approximately 70 years old. Um, we believe that the break occurred as a result of old age. The break sending debris flying into yards and parked cars and left behind a gaping hole along the street. Hopefully, it didn't hurt any of these houses because I know it kind of exploded. I just hope no one got hurt because that's really scary. Water officials say while they were on scene, this truck drove through and got stuck. They had to wait for the truck to get towed before the water could be shut off. That means no water for 10 customers in this area. It got in about 2.30 this morning and water was fine. and got up this morning at 6 o'clock and there was no water on it. Water officials say it could take up to eight hours to get water restored. They'll have to replace the aging cast iron pipe with a steel pipe and then patch the road. In the meantime, these neighbors are making do with a big mess and no water. We weren't expecting it, you know. At least if you know there's going to be work done, you know what to prepare for. So I'm sure we just have to run out of the store and, you know, stock up on some water. In West Mifflin, Caitlin Sykes, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.